What's going on everybody? Bulldog Gaming here. Welcome back to the channel. Sorry it's been a while since I've uploaded anything. Sorry it's been a while since I've tried to record, uh, do any sh live streams. Um, been having some issues with my internet and conductivity between my computer and my recording and streaming software. Uh, as you can see, we are hooking up for a oversized load here. And we are headed... Let me pull up the manifest real quick, because I already got this thing started. <clears throat> We're on our way to uh, uh, Salt Lake City with this load. Uh, so, we're doing an overnight permit load. There we go. Throw on my, out, my extra mirrors. Turn the volume down on the... Uh, uh, truck engine there. Now we're hauling this uh, big O part. Has to be moved to Salt Lake City, Utah from uh, Vernal, Utah. Now I'm only doing this load because um, it pays well. Motor. This is the king of the hill motor, by the way. Um, supposed to be the baddest of the bad uh, motors for uh, heavy haul. It ain't doing anything. I haven't found any new mods. Um, I am on the 139 beta. Uh, checking it out, seeing what it's about. Checking out the uh, new ownable oversight, uh, low boys that they say they have. Um, and seeing what kind of trouble I can get into. So... Uh, like I said, I have been having uh, computer issues, and I've been having internet issues uh, trying to do any kind of uh, recordings or any kind of uh, live streams, so that's why you haven't seen me around. Um, and I, like I said, I do apologize. So I figured I would jump on the bandwagon and do a first look at 139 and what it's about. Uh... So, in the beginning, uh, when you load in, and I'm going to have to take all my real estate on this road. I just remember this from the last time I came through here. Uh, was already setting up, getting things set up for uh, doing this recording. I'd already ran a load so I could go ahead and buy me a truck. Um, because I can't use Vipers. I can't use... Uh, some of my modded trucks yet so kind of out of the question on doing anything like that and we are going to have some uh, traffic issues um, supposed to be heavy haul oriented uh, especially up here in Vernal so that's uh, what we're looking at and dudes over there sitting in the center of the intersection honking so I'll honk back at him. I don't have any of my uh, paint mods in, uh, paint jobs or anything like that in the game. Um, as the 139 beta uh, flips through everything that's going to be doing, uh, then as I see what mods are working, what are compatible, what are incompatible, uh, what's been updated, what's not been updated, then I'll uh, include those mods in the game. Uh... I do plan on putting uh, Bart's uh, tank and flatbed back in and uh, putting them back online uh, to make sure that we don't have anything that's going to go wrong. I do have a new paint scheme for uh, Bart's food grade trailer um, and I do have, uh, if I did it right, I have a new tarp for the tarp tarped load that you can pick up with his step deck. Um, and as you, I do have a couple of mods in. Uh, I have no barriers mod in, and I have uh, uh, I cannot remember. I have a tire mod in because of the American tires. It's not it, uh, Jazzy Cats uh, Alcoa mod, so I can have Alcoa rims and uh, different brands of tires. Uh, choose from 
so I can uh, have a little bit more other than that grayish tone rims and, and grayed out tires. In, um, I have no other mods other than that. Uh, I did test run it without mods <clears throat> just so I could look around a little bit and uh, was planning on recording when I did the look around uh, and just, you know, grab loads and, and, and go and just start building the account then. But uh, some other things came up. Uh, happy Monday, everybody. I know this is not a normal day that I have a video come out. Um, I'm going to try to start getting videos out at least twice to three times a week. Uh, probably Monday, Wednesday, and Friday uh, as I can. As recording, uh, as my computer allows for me to get recordings done until I can do some updates to the uh, RAM. Um, my computer's thinking way too hard, kind of like what I did when I was out on the road. Um, I'm enjoying my retirement from driving over the road. Um, I have picked up a job working for a local school district, uh, doing substitute bus driving and some other things for the school district. So I'm keeping myself busy um, so I'm not bored and so I'm not sitting in front of my computer and wanting to throw it through the window. Uh, other than that, life's going good. Uh, kids are in school full time um, we've had a couple of COVID scares here locally um, where kid uh, w one of my children had to uh, quarantine and we kept him quarantined away from us and then uh, we had to go and take my middle child had to go take her to the hospital and have a COVID check on her uh, luckily it came out it was a uh, sinus a severe sinus infection uh, coupled with really bad allergies so that kind of catches you all up on uh, uh, what's been going on in the real world. Um, in the gaming world, um, who's looking forward to Colorado? I am. I know I am. Um, I've gotten to explore uh, prior to doing the 139 uh, beta. Uh, I noticed that uh, after putting in no barriers, I was able to drive over into Colorado already. Um out of Vernal here and uh, go check out you know some of the the beginning road systems and now that I have the 139 beta and as soon as I get done doing this load and finishing this recording I'm going to go explore because I have seen um, some other uh, content creators that have went and explored uh, over in Colorado to see what they could see where they could go how far they could go I need to kind of couple back a little bit because this is going to be a tight squeeze. Um, and so I'm going to do that, but I'm going to do it off camera. Um, for those of you that have caught me on live stream and able to watch my live streams when I was able to live stream, um, you'll see that I have added a webcam to uh, my repertoire so you can actually see what my ugly mug looks like. Um, and I'm trying different angles, trying different uh, places to place it uh, so I can see and so I can see so you guys can see me, see what's going on, um, especially with my wild and crazy cats. Uh, you might be able to catch uh, my cat George playing fetch in the background occasionally uh, on live stream or my other cat laying on my shoulder now, now that she is uh a little less timid than she was she will lay on my shoulders every now and then or she will lay on my lap while I'm recording or trying to stream um, and don't get me wrong I have tried to stream every day this week uh, midday for at least an hour and I'm driving my computer so hard between the recording software the game and the internet just wanting to crap out uh, I have not been able to do anything um, have been in contact with Risky Clay. Uh, thank you so much for your support, Risky. Um, I greatly appreciate it. I know you've got a lot of things going on in real life down your way. Um, and for those of you that are uh, north of, of uh, I'm going to say US 400, um, we actually have our first chance of the white crap 
uh, today. This was recorded on Sunday, so it would be the uh, today, Monday, that uh, we have the very first day for a chance of the white crap, or AKA snow. I mean snow. Uh, <clears throat> but uh, not looking forward to it because I am a full-time substitute bus driver and I've already had to take over a route uh, full-time for now uh, to alleviate uh, from a driver that got injured. Um, I don't know her extent of injuries other than the fact that uh, she's going to be out for quite a bit. Uh, which is doing pretty good. Um, like I said, kids are doing pretty good with the two happenings with the older two, the younger one. Um, she's just the younger one. She's doing her thing and going on with her schooling and, and life in general. Um, trying to keep the drama down. Uh, for those of you that know me uh, personally and in real life or you know who I am from content creation, uh, from YouTube and uh, Twitch, and you've added me over on Facebook under my real name, uh, you have seen that I've posted up some pictures. I haven't really been all that active on Facebook, um, but uh, you've seen here recently that I've posted up pictures of uh, my oldest doing his own oil changes and doing his own uh, mechanics on his vehicle, uh, just doing light mechanics, learning the basics. And uh, so he's pretty stoked about that. I'm pretty stoked that he's willing to sit there and learn and listen um, what needs to be done, how it needs to be done, and uh, everything like that. So... Uh, trying to keep this about a 20 minute video so don't mind me if I trail off I'm overlooking at my timer and not really paying attention to where I should be driving uh, you know me texting and driving in game uh, not a happy thing I'm usually all over the place uh, but uh, I am looking forward to I'm kind of be last on the bandwagon uh, because there is content being put out by other content creators, but uh, I am looking forward to being able to get Among Us. Uh, those of you that are on my Discord, uh, I'm going to set up an Among Us voice chat and channel chat, uh, uh, text chat on the main Discord. Um, and while I'm recording, I am not in our main Discord. I am in the South Texas RP transport uh, transportation discord doing recording because there's some other things going on in the regular discord and i don't need to i don't need to be disturbing those uh people that are in there trying to do what they're doing with pokemon go and some other games uh, so quite eventful here uh here recently talking about pokemon go um gained a couple of new uh friends through pokemon go that are are uh past friends uh, for, that I've met through content creation uh, that uh, have joined uh, the ranks of my Pokemon Go team that is now spread from Nebraska south to Texas. Um, I do have players that are over in Poland and places like that that I do communicate with through social media uh, on private channels uh, that I'm trying to work, uh, work out times and things to where we can all raid together and do some of these major raids and do some of the uh, uh, mega bosses that have came out uh, coming up this week is Halloween um, we are not doing anything really too spectacular for Halloween uh, family wise or town wise I think the only one that's going to be really doing anything because she's not in trouble with, with uh, parents or school uh, and that is the youngest one. She actually gets to go to her first Halloween party. Uh, I'm kind of scared. It's kind of spooky. Uh, so, looking forward to her being able to go do that. Um, I don't know what she's going as. Uh, probably a, a dressed-down version of Harley Quinn. I don't know. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Halloween's this week. That means we are almost to the end of the year. Almost to Christmas. Almost to Thanksgiving. 
And as you can hear, Princess E in the background saying, "Almost to her birthday, my Christmas, my Christmas, uh, my Christmas baby is Princess E, um, which is sitting at the right, watching what I'm doing and trying to get pointers on how to start doing content creation uh, because she actually has a class where she has to do uh, stuff for content creation for her class, um, and it's kind of scary. I now have two in high school." I have two in high school, and next year I have one that will be graduating. It makes me feel older than I already am, even though my body swears I'm down. I'm in my 90s, uh, so it is kind of it is kind of scary. Uh, scary? You mean like terrifying? Yeah, very terrifying. As uh, Princess E talks in the background there. Uh, right now, I believe my cat Georgia is uh, taking a five-minute break because he has lost his fuzzy balls that he likes to play with. Um, and we don't own this house, so I can't just rip up the cabinet and rip apart things to get to where they are because they went under a cabinet, over a lip, and they are now lost and gone forever under the cabinet. Sucks to be him right now. But uh, <coughs> I did get on the Internet and did find the manufacturer of, of said fuzzy balls and uh, have ordered him some fuzzy balls and let's see how many more times I can say fuzzy balls on this recording uh, but uh, things are looking talk to a technician um, ever since they did some janking with the system uh, last March I had really good uh, internet and then it is just slowly just died off uh, to where it's not really wanting to work like it's supposed to because I'm supposed to be at what I was when I had Cox Cable internet uh, I am on uh, uh, oh fiber fiber internet here and it's supposed to be faster but it's not uh, because we're conglomerated and so tight with everything um that it it just jams up the system because it can't handle uh, so many people on at once during certain times of the day, certain times of the night. And this is going to be fun. I do know this route. Like I said, I've already taken this route once. Um, I do know there's a tunnel coming up. And uh, this thing will gripe at me. I do know there is a tunnel coming up uh, to uh, that is going to be a little bit tight. This will be the second piece that I've taken to where we're going. Uh, I've already taken one piece. I need to take the load of tires when they're available. Uh, and I believe there's one more piece that goes to this, this quarry. And I'm, I didn't realize the quarry existed uh, until just recently. Uh, because I hadn't been over in this part of, <clears throat> of Utah on the map for quite some time. Uh, and I am going to be adding my own stuff to the, to the uh, uh, oversized pilot vehicles, uh, with the exception of the police vehicles. But the Dodge and the Ford truck that is in game for the pilot vehicles, I'm going to be adding my own stuff uh, for the uh, South Texas RP transport. Um, which will actually be pretty cool. And this thing's probably going to gripe at me because I'm not getting in that lane because I need all my real estate to make this left-hand turn. I do know this from the first time I did it. There we go. Car zone. Um, I am going to be adding back in I, the, the names where car zone will be auto zone and stuff like that. Uh, like I said, I do have no boundaries in uh, the map mod, or the yeah, it's a map mod, no boundaries. To where, as you can see, I don't have the yellow X's, the red X's, or anything like that. I can actually go off into that subdivision over there if I wanted to and do photo shoots uh, for for RP kind of stuff. Um, I can actually drive over there by that uh, lake right there and go down by the dock if I wanted to. I did that it I did that for a purpose so I can go in and uh, do like some of the people do when they do new photo shoots for their trucks, their trailers, and stuff like that. 
uh, so I can actually drive. Here's that first tunnel. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, it looks a little tight. I'm going to center up with my left tires right on the hash. Hash marks, or as we call in the real world, uh, the zipper. So I know I will be able to clear height and width without them griping that you need to be in the center of us. Uh, but uh, I plan on doing some photo shoots uh, off of the beaten path, off in these areas that I can access with without no boundaries, and uh, putting them up on, on uh, the Discord and also doing a, a, photo, a photo flip of uh, some of my uh, paint jobs that I have done in the past and current uh, set to music. I have to look long and hard to find music that won't get me in trouble with YouTube. Um, but that is that is in due time. So catch some breaks. See like right here going under this under this bridge. Uh, there's actually a barrier there. It's supposed to be a barrier there. And no, I still have not set up a steering wheel for this, for my computer. Um, I will be doing that when I get my new computer in the future. Um, I am going to set up with the uh, uh, Thrustmaster system, uh, wheels, pedals, and shifter. Uh, but that is a future date. I think I can get down on that road, but I don't know. Uh, I think so. This is where I had some issue with the uh, the, uh, the dump bed uh, for the truck that I'm hauling now. Uh, I actually got snagged up in this area on the sign that's coming up about the engine brakes being prohibited, blah, blah, blah. Uh, I don't care about that engine brake stuff. Never have, never will. Um, loud pipes save lives. I'm between you two idiots. Because <sighs> I'm driving with my tires over the le the middle lane. At uh, the middle of the lane. Due to how wide I have to turn. How wide I am. Because the dimensions on this. You can't haul it close to the. Where you're supposed to. my clearance on both sides. I clipped that motorcycle the first time I went through here. Um, but yeah, things are things are going pretty well. Uh, I hope to have this rendered up and uploaded uh, by 1 o'clock. Um, hopefully you're watching this after 1 o'clock today or 1300, those that understand military time. Uh, which I will be happy and I will be stoked that it is up. Yeah, we'll just set the cruise control. We got about a half mile, about a mile and a half to our uh, turn off the 10600 10, south. which is an actual road name, street name, in Salt Lake City. I have been on this road, and I can point out some of the places that I have been that are not depicted on the map, but I can, I can, I can pinpoint uh, where we come out of Provo up to this exit here. Um... 151 West, yes. Okay, I am correct on the road that I am. Uh, you come up here, you would make a right, you would go over to the little gray hash that shows uh, there's a road there. Um, there is a place that I used to pick up there for... Uh, there's a trailer sales location right there, and I used to pick up uh, utility trailers, uh, utility brand trailers there. And then here, where we're at now, crossing this bridge, 
um, I would actually, yeah, I would actually be on this side going um, off over there where the big tall brown building is just down the street. Well, you can kind of see the white building over there next to that brown building um, is where Dannon yogurt is made. Uh, it's going to be right off of this little road that's coming up here on our right uh, where we make a left. There's a road that goes to the right, I believe. Um, up here at the stoplight. Uh, nope. In real life, there's actually a road that goes through there. Come on. Keep moving. Just because I stepped on the brakes doesn't mean you need to. Actually, it's up and around the bend there. But it would be that white building over there. This school that we're getting ready to go by does exist, and it is not a truck route that we are on um, for this kind of haul. We, I'll show you where we would have actually came across because that's the rec center. There's a high school, a college. That's City Hall. There's a high school and a college in the same area. Uh, you don't go through the residential areas in Salt Lake City other than uh, specified roads. Excuse me. Uh, like this road up here on the right goes back off there. You don't go in there with a big truck, especially a heavy haul. So, as soon as we get this delivered, we will end the recording. Um, it's a little bit longer than what I was planning. It's a little bit longer than 20 minutes, but hey, you're getting a full load here. Uh, and we're not that far away. That place right there that you see here coming up on the right, um, there is a coffee shop right there in real life. So, I've been able to, and we're actually driving out to where a mine is in real life also. There's a lot of things out here. St. Uh, not St. George, Utah. Uh, we're actually over up near Provo. We're back over by Provo, the other side of Provo, Utah. In real life, this is where we would be. We would be just outside of Provo. And instead of getting on the interstate, we would have went across the bridge, continued on that road, down to the other side of those hills right there, came back up, made a right, and then came up to the road that we're on now. See, I'm hung up right there. Uh, would have made a right onto this road and then came in that way for the heavy haul route. But this is a game, so we do what the game wants us to do on a lot of things. I just critique, critique a lot of things, and I thought I would bring up one of my critiques. Um, you can see the uh, big dump truck up there on the uh, horizon. This is also where... Uh, the Salt Lake City's uh, landfill is is over in this area. This is where their trash is transfer transported to. Uh, so it's going to be up here on the left that we're going to be making a left. And then uh, one of these days I'll actually show you where I'm talking and do a flyover using that nice little button to do the flyover. Yep, I got I got permission to do this. Now this is the stupid part. I did that last time. 
turn off the Jake break. They should just open those two right there. And I do... I'm going to re... Uh, upload into my game. I'm going to start using uh, Ruda stuff again. Uh, because I do miss using Ruda stuff. I have all three of his trucks I've paid for. Uh, and he's, he's frantically working trying to get all of the uh, updates for 139 ready to go. So all we got to do is just download up and put in our folders and go. I've asked a couple people if they would do a heavy haul, an actual heavy haul pack, uh, motors, transmissions, and uh, drive systems, and length for a triaxle. All right, now this is another one that's going to be interesting. Because it's a round, rounded over tunnel. Don't want to get too far right, don't want to get too far left. Because you'll see why, as soon as we get out of this tunnel, why you don't want to get too far right, it starts tightening up, and it becomes like you're following a snake. <clears throat> Gives you a bit more of a challenge to uh, get down to where you got to deliver this. Right. And they have the uh, two pink, three pink this time uh, for breast cancer awareness. I thought that was a uh, glitch in the paint, and it wasn't. It is actually for breast cancer awareness, and they are going to leave those in. Ah, look, school bus. Coming down too fast. Well, you are on an incline. Right, so now we start cutting back to the right here. Staying center of the, on the right. So we don't run into these power poles and light poles. It says 25 miles an hour, but Not doing this length of a load and having to make that jank of a turn. Give me a second here to uh, figure out if I'm swinging this wide enough or not without running into things and causing more damage to my truck. left here we gotta make a right here yep I honked my horn at him now we're on the dirt part Do not have to stop at the X. We know where we're delivering this. Turn the Jake off, we don't need it. Drag those axles through that little ditch right there.
This is part two of, I believe it's a four parts that you bring to here. that will do it guys thank you so much for spending some time on my channel i want to welcome all new subscribers to the channel if you are new to the channel's first video you see and you want to see more and see when i actually am able to get things uploaded feel free to hit that subscribe button hit that bell notifications hit the bell and, and don't forget to hit the like if you like what you see and don't forget to leave me a comment uh tell me how your day how your week how your month how your year is going and always remember on 2021, uh, on 1-1-2021, one, one, instead of yelling Happy New Year, yell Jumanji. We want out of this game. Thanks for watching, y'all.